Hey everyone, Shin Virtuality here, and today I thought we'd uh, jump into a little bit of Dead Cells. Uh, Dead Cells is by no means a new game. Uh, it's been out for consoles for a couple of years. I think it just got released on Android last year. Um, but the reason I wanted to sort of do this, it got its first premium DLC package, the Bad Seed update, and I had purchased it. So I wanted to go through, do a couple of runs, maybe one or two, uh, see if I can sort of collect any of the um, weapons that are featured in it and just sort of go from there. So let's jump into a game and see what we can do. Now I've already started this and I've collected my gold, but uh, you know what? This is a good starting point, so let's go on. Um, if you haven't played Dead Cells before, it is a sort of a Metroidvania uh, rogue-lite game. Uh, and rogue-like games are games where you sort of progress through a dungeon. Oh, no need for healing. Um, you progress through a dungeon. And if you die, you start over from the beginning and go through the entire thing again. Um, and I guess what makes it unique is that you slowly accumulate resources and abilities and stuff to make yourself stronger. Uh, hence all these orbs up here. So like I said, anyone sort of familiar with the game uh, <laughs> knows that. I haven't really gotten that much into it, but you know, it is a little bit of a grind and then I have been enjoying multiple hours of this game, so I figured why not do a quick play and just check it out. So one thing I did unlock is the Royal Gardeners. I don't know why the screen was... Uh, flashy, but hopefully that'll be the end of that. So we'll put on our Royal Gardeners. Um, I tend to go for, you got three areas of expertise. You got Brutality, Tactics, and Protection, I think it is, for the green. Uh, I usually go pretty much Tactics. Uh, I put in Brutality just because I love the uh, the weapons that you get. This heavy axe type thing is uh, is quite useful. And we'll see if we can get to the new areas without getting hit. I'm sure that won't last. Trying to be careful here. Um, I've gotten to a point where I've unlocked a couple of relics and you need the relics to sort of get yourself to some of the other sections of the game. Um, where am I going here? I'm already lost. Uh, and, uh, let's go through there. Ah, because I was supposed to go the other way. <laughs> Got it. Um, as you progress, all right, so here you go, you got one of these scrolls of power. And here's where you start pumping your abilities. So you can select survivalist. So yeah, you can pick one of these. I usually just go with tactics. Uh, how do you see me through the door? Oh, I got hit. Already, I see one of the new weapons, so we're going to get it. Uh, do I want to take the bullgun over? You know what, we'll take it instead of firebrands. I do like the firebrands as well, but like I said, I did want to showcase off some of the newer stuff that, are, that is found in this DLC. Uh, 
and the blowgun is pretty good for that. It deals a lot of poison damage, I think. Uh, Alright, so... <laughs> Out here, secret area. Message. Watchman left a little note for his colleagues. John, who is watching the castle gates, is no more. What happened between him and the king, I wonder. What Grant did, but judging by the spear, they must have had quite the difference of opinion. Yeah, okay. And you get little story bits like that. Uh, okay, so. Yeah. Here's one of the. Uh, one of the. Oh! Didn't get out of the way. Um. Okay, so watermelon. Ah, I didn't turn this back to default food. I'm on fruitarian, I think. Uh, but yeah, we'll heal. Um, you're able to take out some of the floor based on uh, uh, sections that are weak, I guess. Uh, and if you have a room. Oh. Uh, so you may see me as I'm going down doing a bit of a ground pound like that. That's what will shatter the uh, weak floors. Special to shop. Uh, okay, so I've unlocked this. This is just... I'm gonna leave it alone for now. It's nice that I unlocked it. I grabbed the one thing that I could get from it, which I believe was a different outfit. Uh, so, we're still... Oh yeah, I think the blowgun does extra damage if the enemy is unaware. So let's... Another scroll of power. I think there's two in this beginning dungeon as well. Um, as you go through the dungeons... Oh, chest! We got... We'll take the double crossbow and medic with you. Uh, we're not going to get any... Oh, you know what? We are. Uh, we're going to go with the mushroom boil. It's sort of like a little companion, again, from the uh, from the bad seed. So let's get uh, him out, because he'll help us. Okay, so here's one of the exits, but we're not going to take it. Three separate exits for this particular. Uh, you know what? We can teleport. Uh, so let's go. Let's go up there because this is where. Okay, so that we need a room to make that vine grow. Teleporter. And then, yes, here's the other rune that you need in order to get the new, the new section. As you can see, he's taking care of uh, enemies pretty nicely. The, the dilapidated, dilapidated arbore, arboretum. That's where we want to go, but we still have a little bit of this dungeon left. Uh, we're not making any of the bonuses for getting through this, so let's explore just a little bit more. enemies. There you go. And there's the toxic sewers. Okay. I think we're pretty much done here. So let's... Uh, 
plenty of flesh. And let's head on to the next level. So if you are able to clear the section in a certain time frame or killing certain enemies without getting touched, uh, you get bonus rooms. But I did neither, so um, we'll just talk to this gentleman where we can deposit our cells. this one next so so let's go back plenty of stuff to sort of unlock as you go through dungeons and collect cells and get to these midway points um, you know, um, upgrades for when you start a run uh, traps powers weapons whether in any of the three categories uh, ranged shields Plenty of shields, as you tell. I'm not, uh, I'm not the shield guy, but uh, you know, you, the game doesn't penalize you for doing shields if you're quick to do parries and such. Uh, the game will reward you for doing those uh, mutations, which we'll get to in a moment, and efforts. Uh, so we got reforge, and I'm not going to be doing anything right yet. I think my stuff is still a little bit too low. Would re-roll modifiers for the mushroom boy. Mushroom boy. <laughs> I'm saying that wrong too. But again, we could come across one a little bit better later on. So we'll leave it for now. Uh, and then here's the mutations. Mutations are you can collect three, and it will um, sort of add to your overall character as you progress through the run. So. Um, I'll take Tranquility because I'm not really sure what I can use or how, but we'll do it for now and we'll head on to the next section. So here is part of the new dungeons that you can partake in. It is quite nice. New enemies, more mushroom boys, which reminds me I should get my own going. Between those big mushroom fellows, uh, another section of ground pound. Try and speed this up a little bit because I've already been wasting enough time. I can spend hours just uh, going through the, the dungeons trying to not get hit or do any of that stuff. But sometimes it just doesn't work in my favor. plants down here uh, and they're mainly used for jumping up higher just trying not to get hit here the scroll of power or the scroll of something we'll see what Found the exit to the ramparts, but we'll explore a little bit more still. I believe. Um, 
button. No, oh, three plus. So, marginally better, but I'm not gonna, do I? Nah, I don't need to spend the extra 5,000 currency to get it. For now, we'll see, uh, we'll see how things hold up as we progress. Uh, and already I'm getting lost. Um, busy down here. <laughs> okay, so we have another tool there, but I don't have the rune to climb the walls there, so I'm unable to get it in my current state. Uh, which is fine. The uh, game still has plenty of offers, even if uh, you can't reach those isolated areas. about themselves. Now, let's... <laughs> now that we deployed the trap, there's no one left. Uh, okay, so we've actually cleared out all of this area. So let's jump back to the middle and head the other way. Just this rhythm in 
Uzunki 4 Plus. Uh, and it will take over for our Nutcracker. Because it is also a weapon that you acquire in this new DLC. more that needs to die. Ooh, that one too. Yes, we are. And okay, dead. It's all fun and dandy. And we have to go down and get out of here. All right. Oh, another. Jeez. Just when you think you've explored it all, there's more. Come on, down. Huh? Another teleporter. And something we can get to. as I would like it. Um, whenever you come across something, if you don't want it, the uh, best thing to do is just recycle it for cash, which we'll do here. And, and we're better off being where we are. Right. Let's quickly go down to this side here. That first. Now. <laughs> I don't know why the mushroom boys say YOLO and then jump off the cliff, but it's certainly funny whenever I see it happen. Uh, okay, get ourselves some. Protein there. Uh, only brutality and survival. So if I gotta pick a secondary, I'm gonna go with brutality. No sense wasting them, even if it's not something that you're doing. Who's in depth? So it's not what I was actually going for. I don't think I could get down there either. Could be wrong. Never able to. cells into what I want to unlock next. Uh, I just did a big purchase, so I don't think I'll have enough money for any modifiers. Nothing that I would want anyway. So we'll leave it. Uh, I will take...
Hmm. I wonder where I have to actually get the ammo for weapons plus times two. I thought it said plus two before. Times two is much better. And considering that I'm using the blowgun quite a lot, uh, it might actually be worth my while. So you know what? Let's go for it. Why not? I was going to take necromancy, but I'm not putting any points into survival, so maybe just best to do with that. Um, just to let you guys know, though, uh, this game is no joke. Um, the levels are actually quite hard, so don't feel bad if you purchase and don't really um, feel like you're getting anywhere. Um, I certainly felt like that before, and especially coming into new sections like this, I am just like totally like, oh, what do I do? Um, but we're here. Uh, let's oh, yeah, pretty much avoid that. And we got these big enemies. Ow! Oh. There, we got him. <laughs> he has uh, certainly wrecked shop for me before, so... Oh, now we have a, an elite enemy. Oh, there's just no stopping. Ow, 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 this is not good. my mushroom boy. I'm gonna have to wait till he comes back. I don't want to take him on alone. And right above him I had a bunch of blow dart enemies, so uh all right, mushroom boy. Put that there. Ooh, come on. Alright, there he is half and done. Oh and he gives an amulet for trouble, so we will definitely do that. Right, and then those. Oh, where did Mushroom Boy go? Did he die? I hate when Mushroom Boy dies. Ah! No cloak gun enemies. First, there, more. Ah. <laughs> Got my back. Yeah, I should, uh, uh, I actually want to kill Mushroom Boy. See about surviving without him. This level's a little confusing as well, so I might backtrack a little bit just to, uh, yeah. There we go. I uh, have a 
storekeeper up there, but I don't think he has anything they want. Oh no! Automatic might be nice to upgrade from my number two that I have, but you know what? Don't have the cash for it right now. to just look around just in case. Oh, I'm gonna have to take another swig of uh Arg! Jeez. Right. <laughs> I think we're okay for now. So let's do this. Um yeah, let's go down here. I think we have to go down now. Oh, and that's... <laughs> Alright. We weren't getting to the Swarm King... Queen... We weren't getting to the mid-level boss in this run. But you could sort of see how things like this go, and then you just sort of respawn. You pick up your bag of... Gold, uh, which isn't quite, uh, well, I think it's what I had the last when leaving. Uh, and you're pretty much at base level again, so you're starting to run over. But you can just sort of see how the appeal is. It's very nice, fast paced um, controller support, so um, if you weren't hearing before, I'm sure you know now. Um, but yeah. Um, Nice controller support, nice keeping things nice and fluid. It does have on-screen controls, but ultimately, if you're playing this and want to play at a high level, get yourself a controller. Um, but yeah, it, like I said, spending a ton of time on this. Um, haven't really been doing much of the quick plays recently. I did want to do a quick play of Wild Rift, uh, the new League of Legends mobile game, um, but. I'm not a big mobile player, unfortunately, and just that hasn't really panned out. So something may come about it in the future, but I think the people who want that type of content are better served to get it from uh, people who actually are in deep with the game. And you know what? That's fine. I'm not going to be playing everything on mobile, unfortunately. Um, if there is something you'd like to see, you know, shoot me a comment and. I'd love to hear what you have to say, but, uh, you know, if it's not something that isn't in my wheelhouse, then, you know, don't don't feel too bad if, uh, if I'm not going to do it justice. Uh, I think that's the, sort of the case with, uh, with the League of Legends game. Uh, but, you know, for now, we'll just keep it on, keep it on. 
things have been a little bit stressful for work and such, so, you know, best thing to do, play games, game on, have fun, you know, when the thing that I usually say at the end of all these videos. So, if you enjoyed what you saw out of Dead Cells, uh, by all means, pick up the game. Uh, it is a premium title, so you would have to pay a little bit for it, but I think it's well worth the price tag that uh, that it offers, especially on mobile. Uh, and then get yourself the the Bad Seed DLC, uh, because as you can see, uh, plenty of fun to be had in those new areas. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, smack that like button, leave me a comment, and subscribe to my channel for more mobile gaming goodness because you'll never know what I'll be picking up next. This has been Shin Virtuality. Game on, have fun, and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye. Looks like I had a bad time with it. With the ax? No, the job in luck. Because I'm dead. Bye guys.